Hey everybody, it's Mama J and we are back with the Rolling Stones cards. We're trying to store, score some more guitar picks and the stickers. We've gotten a few, but I want to score some more. And we're going to see how much of the card set we can complete. I did buy a whole case, so there's 24 packs in a case. And we are doing three per video. Get six cards and a tattoo. We do have some dupes on the tats, but so far not too bad. Ooh, ooh. I think we might have got this one. Let's see what cards we got here. All right, we didn't score any extras, but we didn't score any dupes. The Emotional Rescue LP gave the Stones a number one album in the UK for the first time since the band issued Goat's Head Soup in 73. That was that gross cover we seen. The rocker band traveled to its 2002 Licks Tour media affair at the Van Cortelent Park aboard a, gi a giant yellow inflatable airship. Wonder if they were high. <laughs> Charlie Watts published his o Ode to a High Flying Bird in December 1964 to honor jazz great Charlie Yardbird Parker. The Maisel's Brothers' epic concept movie Gimme Shelter documents the Stones' fateful performance at Atlantamont in 1969. Charlie Watts was born June 2, 1941 in England and played his first Rolling Stones concert at the Bedline Pub in 1963. The 1973 tour of Europe had come to the rest in the West Berlin, Germany after playing 42 shows in 21 cities. Ooh, ooh. No, no. Wow, that's crazy. Get the next pack open. I don't know that my mind's holding all this, but that's some trivia knowledge, ain't it? They're like giving us all kinds. Ooh, we got something. We got something. All right, this is a trip triplets. We got triplets. All right, and then we got this, which we did get one of these, but it wasn't this one. But we did get a holographic. I think it might have been the regular one. I don't remember now. Let's see which cards we got here. The shiny one. The Rolling Stones closed out their 1989 American tour in Atlanta City with three big shows at the convention center. It's pretty awesome. The waiting on a Friend video was filmed on the location at St. Mark's Bar and Grill in Lower Manhattan's Greenwich Village. 1975's tour of the Americans played a total of 44 concert dates and opened in Baton Rouge on the 1st of June. Ooh, wrong way. Keith Richards was present at the coordination ceremony for Queen Elizabeth II at London's Westminster Abbey back in 1952. As a kid, I'm sure. <laughs> Four flickers captured the excitement of the Licks tour with complete sets from New York, London, and Paris, France. Last card in that pack, the world's greatest rock and roll band, is a slogan first connected to the Rolling Stones during their 1969 U.S. tour. You wanted the greatest band. You got the greatest band. Isn't that what Kiss says? Phil Stanley? I think um, Stones might have beat y'all to that. All right, let's see what we got in our last pack here. Uh, oh, okay, well, this is, we did get a card, so that's completely different. Looks like we didn't get any extras this go around, but we didn't get any dupes either, so that's always a plus. The Rolling Stones, named, emerged from an early Muddy Waters rhythm and blues song titled Rolling Stone back in 1962. Pretty cool, look like uh, Beverly Hillbillies almost. <laughs> the Rolling Stones played Fame Wembley Stadium for the very first time in 1982 during the European Tattoo You outing. Right, let's go to the next one. The Juilliard Music School in Manhattan showcased the Rolling Stones' extraordinary and bigger bang press event in 2005. That's pretty cool. The renamed Urban Jungle Tour began in Rottendam on May 18th. Rottendam on May 18th, 1990, and closed 45 shows later at Wembley Stadium. It's pretty awesome. Uh, the Voodoo Lounge World Tour collected an astonishing 320 million in gross receipts from its spin around the planet. 
The bridge to the Babylon tour got started on September 23, 1997 in Chicago, Illinois with a pair of Windy City stu uh, Stadium tours. With a pair of Windy City Stadium concerts. So again, let me know what you think. We didn't score anything extra, but we didn't get any dupes. So we got to add, you know, 18 new cards to our collection. Don't forget that comment can get you into a giveaway. And don't forget to stick around, check out my Patreons. They get something every month. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!